Welcome back to the channel, pleasant good morning, pleasant Sunday morning to each and everybody here listening right now to the September the 4th, my viewers. Many who have lived, many who have died, we have to give thanks to be alive same way and we just continue to keep the strength, continue to steadfast, continue to look forward up to the sky to the most high for blessings and guidance and protection. So right now, you know, so we still have to bring the story, still have to bring the news cross. So this same bird, body, found in motor vehicle on Mona Road. The this same bird remains of a man was found in a motor vehicle mm-hmm. on Mona Road in St. Andrew in the wee hours of Sunday morning. The grisly discovered was made in the vicinity of the University of the West Indies Mona campus. Police are now gathered at the scene. Boy, my viewers, my tell so Jamaica is not surprising. Yeah, man, Jamaica is not surprising, my viewers. It's not surprising. Every day when I get up and hear something grossly happen, something crazy, my viewers. Jamaica. And nothing new, and nothing strange. The 87s them continue to wreak havoc in the country, my viewers. But right now, we don't even know. Oh, this thing I got stop. How to put a stop to it? It's clueless. But we just have to just continue to stick together. Give information if there's any. So right now, we don't have to do the right thing, my viewers. Because I want to see them one. Them are going to come back at. Policeman shot and injured in Santa Cruz robbery. A police constable has been rushed to hospital after he was shot and injured doing a robbery at a supermarket in Santa Cruz on Saturday night. The reports are that sometime after 9 p.m., the policeman who is assigned to the St. Elizabeth Quick Response Team was at the establishment when our men entered and held up the supermarket. It is reported that during the robbery, the policeman was shot and his service weapon stolen. It is unclear if the robbers fled with cash from the supermarket. The injured policeman was taken to hospital where he was since been admitted. Boy, my viewers, my turn on say. We sorry the policeman couldn't get the chance to put on at least two or three for the old dirty corner boy. Yeah, man, my viewers, I'm sorry they never get the chance to put on two or three on them. Three men arrested after firearm ammunition seized in Rockford, Kingston. Three men were arrested on Friday, September the 3rd in connection with the seizure of a firearm and ammunition by the Kingston Eastern Police. The illegal gun and ammunition were seized during an operation along Whitward Road. Reports are that about 9.30 p.m. a team of officers was on patrol when the police observed three men standing alone the roadway. The men were accosted and searched, and a Smith & Wesson 9mm pistol with a magazine containing two 9mm rounds of cartridges. Two 9mm cartridges were found. The men were taken into custody. However, their identities are being withheld pending further investigation. 
police more want to know Lego the identity of the man they want to catch them. The people they want to know who are the dirty 87 them. Lego the name them man. Westmoreland man convicted of murdering Negro couple. Detectives in Westmoreland have been con- commanded by their superiors following Friday handing down of a guilty verdict in the case against Jeremy Levy who was accosted of murdering a couple at their home in Western and Negril in the parish in 2019. Levy's trial lasts for nine weeks in the Westmoreland Circuit Court. At the end of the trial, he was found guilty of one count of murder and one count of manslaughter. His case is to be transferred to the Home Circuit Court where the sentencing is scheduled for September the 16th. Some pleasant viewers and my subscribers continue to like, share, comment and subscribe. Turn on the post notification bell whenever you subscribe so you'll be amongst the first to receive a notification. Pleasant good morning and thank you.